Well, hello there, mortals. Welcome back to the second episode of Loop Hero. We got our ass whipped in the first episode from this guy here, the leech. He was cheating big time. There's no way we could have defeated him. So, let's try our luck. In the second run, which I doubt we'll be able to kill. Let's have a look in here. Something is flashing here. Blood Grove and... Chrono Crystals. Double the effects of daily passings on adjacent tiles. Oh, this is good. I like this. Can be placed near a forest adjacent to the road. Its roots bar enemies that have less. Oh, quite good. We can't take too many. Spawn chests near the starting of the loop. Enemies on adjacent tiles can be ghosts. No, I don't want that. Let's get rid of this. Yeah, let's try it with these two new things. Uh, nothing else. We can click. Let's do this. Bum bum. Let's go. All right, we're on double speed, double time. Let's kill some of these guys. Now, those of you who haven't watched the first episode, um, I'm not gonna go. Not gonna go through any of this stuff. If you guys want to know how the game is played, do take a look at the first episode. And you'll get the explanation of why I'm doing the things that I do. Okay, let's go, treasury. Let's do this. Right. As I was saying, if you guys haven't watched the uh, how to play and me explaining what these things are you can watch the first episode i go through it quite detail if you guys are interested in that so basically this mellow heals us for 2 hp at the start of each day, so when we go through our cozy camp, you'll heal us. Uh, cemetery. Draw some baddies. Should I put it here or not? I should put it here. I put it. I put it here. Right. Let's go. Now those of you who have not played this game or bought this game before, uh, I highly recommend it. Looks very fun. I like it a lot. Increase the effects of... Double the effects of daily passing on adjacent tile. The... Daily... Doubles the effect of daily passing on adjacent tiles. Heals for 2 XP. Double the effects. Should we put it on? Uh, let's keep it first. I don't know where to put it on. go this time i think we're gonna do like a farming run where um
where we're just going to try our best to get as much materials as possible without dying and not kill the leech and come back with those materials and upgrade our camp that's what we're gonna do use a random resource uh, after placing anything on adjacent tile can't be built cheese into anything. Goes back there. Oh. Chrono crystal. I wonder where the double effects of a day's passing on adjacent tile. Double the effects of a day's passing. a spider on a adjacent tile once a day. How about if we put it here? Does it need to be on the spider tile? Ha. Huh. here and see what happens spawns a spider on adjacent tile once a day so it spawns two now is it or something not really sure let's see first time using that It is quite good in our first run. Chrono Trigger. Chrono Trigger. What am I saying? <laughs> uh, yes. And no. Let's put it there and see what happens. There's tree spiders here now. That's a good place to put it just now. Shit, how come we're dying so fast? Does it get harder? What's going on? We're getting our ass whipped.
cemetery. Uh, no, I'm not gonna do that. It seems hard as it is already. be able to make it true. Might. Vampires. Spiders are okay. There we go, we got a mountain up now. a chance right now come on grow 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 move okay I think we 
shouldn't put anything down now. Chillax first. Oh, cow. Thanks to a small group of us dragged you here, it wasn't easy. How could you fight off all those monsters? They nearly killed me. That's always interesting. Many of them vanished right before our eyes. Some we managed to avoid, but I think most of the beasts were gone even before we left the camp. I think the trips are deeply connected to your memories, my friend. Every time fall, every everything falls apart as soon as you're unconscious. Yes, and we do not have enough. What is that? Food supply is what we need. Ah, oh, it would be good if we have some potions right there. Uh, yeah. Let me see. Battlefield. Let's let's just go. Let's go again. It's just bad luck. We didn't have a weapon with us. I shouldn't have put down all those um, things there when I, when I didn't have a weapon, right? So that was our mistake there. That was our mistake. Vampire? Three to five. No. Let's go, let's go. Alright, got a spider's nest going on now. There's a skeleton. No. up slowly until we get stronger before we put any weird stuff around.
show you where we can put that. Place near a forest adjacent to the road. Its roots devour enemies and have. Uh huh. Okay. Can be placed next to a grove. Why oh, can't be placed here? at the start of each day. Let's go, let's go. Give us the goodies. Vampire Mansion. Ooh, here we go. What's this? Nothing good. Mellow. Double the passings. Mountain. Come on. Ooh, goblin Camp. I don't like that. So swallow him whole. Nice. Oop, how come? Oh, this one is double. Hey, okay. it didn't heal.
trap. That didn't do anything. Beacon. Okay, that was a good spot. Take him out. Decrease the maximum number. didn't do anything. Okay, what happened to that one? to our thingy. Nice. 
nine to twenty. Not so good. This one. Fourteen. Nope. Where are we? Okay. Um. Hmm. a lot better. Two. Four. Fourteen to turn. No. Lock. Another rock. Counter. Twelve. Vation six now. Cemeteries. the beacon. Nice. Okay. Found something new. We learned something new there. Vampirism. I think we should put that. Yeah. Sits. 
see. Right. Is there anything we want to destroy? Nope. It's too hard for us. Ooh, flesh golem? The hell? Oh, oh, ouch. Ouch, wow. Ooh, that guy hits. That guy hits. Die, 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 die. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Wow, 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 wow. Look at all this stuff. Oh. Tax evasion. Yes, yes, yes. Mm, counter magic. This one's. Damage. The Ooh, this looks good. Yeah, we're gonna equip this before we end the round. I think we're gonna make it, man. Is it multiplying here? I still don't quite understand.
Oh, we can kill one of those. Cool, I didn't know that. Another success, you return and we still remember you. Unbelievable. Yeah, it's good to be back, but I hardly call it a success. My old memories of the world are gone. The path is empty again, and there's only darkness everywhere I look. Interesting. So technically, you remember that you there are things you have forgotten. We should find a way to use that. Let's talk about something more positive. We managed to tidy up this place. It's time for the next step. What do you have in mind? Expanding the camp. We have all sorts of craftsmen, from cooks to alchemists, but they all need a place to work. But we can't use the materials from around here. You turn away for a second and a branch or a stone you have just found and it's gone. I'm afraid only you can solve the problem. The materials that survive your trip always look suitable for building. But these are just stones and splinters. How can you build something with that? Curious, eh? I notice it with the fire you've made. The things you obtain somehow infect everything similar with stability. Only in small amounts, but it's still something. Even a small branch is enough to make a wooden wall exist without constant supervision. Okay, what are we supposed to do? We do not have enough of all that. Let's build something. And we still can't build anything. Really? Really guys? Huh. Can we upgrade this? What's this? Smelly. It can't be destroyed. Do anything. Still needs a lot. Well, I guess that's it for this episode, guys. I'll see you guys again soon. Perhaps we can gather some materials before we continue on our journey. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And until next time. I'll reap you later.